now imagine a better world, one with proper guidance and the technology to bring about global. Cuddy, he's the industrial revolution personified. <laughs> Cuddy, he's fat Bezos. Thanks, space god, that Rosalina showed up to save the day. Not that Bowser needed saving. He's what been. What the fuck? Two four, rocking at two four. I got like twenty four hours on me. Man, I'm rocking mad time. I've been on mad time, man. I'm like y'all nigga get on your feet. I ain't saying no names when I get in that room, man. You already know I'm gonna keep it discreet. Ladies and gentlemen, I am back with another banger. Huh? What'd he say? Man, y'all heard me. I said I'm back with another banger of reaction for y'all boys, man. Amen. Say, man. We got some more death battle for y'all, bro. Okay, listen. This one just dropped. This is a new Bowser versus Eggman death battle, bro. This, this, junk, this junk dead ass dropped like three hours ago. I woke up, saw the notification, and I was already new to comments where. What do you do? 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 Right now, bro. Damn. Now, Bowser versus Eggman, I ain't gonna lie. I'm rooting for Big Bowser. Big, a uh, big Bowser, bro. Eggman, I'm not, I, like, I'm not really, listen, I like Sonic. Shadow's my favorite character in the whole series, but, like, Eggman, Eggman always seems too goofy for me. Like, I know the IDW comics of Eggman are, like, somewhat threatening, and I really want to get into that, like, get into that shit. But, like, as it, as it currently stands, Eggman is kind of too goofy. This man, Bowser, is a great father, right? He's a great fucking father. He can breathe fire, and, like, he's a simp. Just like me. Like, bruh, I ain't gonna lie. So I'm rooting for Big Bowser. All right, when first things first, Cuddy, why is Marvel Snap right in my face, Cuddy? It's been fucking Marvel Snap. This shit about to piss me off. Like, you for real did all these amazing trailers for the Marvel Universe, and it's a fucking card game? Are you fucking for real? Whatever, yeah. This battle is sponsored by Marvel Snap and Prize Picks. Fuck Marvel Snap and fuck Prize Picks. Ah, ma, ma, ma. Bowser versus yes, Dr. Eggman, the okay. king of the Koopas and the baddest of badniks. Okay. They're not alone. He's Wiz and I'm Boomstick. And it's our job to analyze their weapons, armor, and skills to find out who would win a death, death battle. battle. Okay, but who's each other's top dog? I know, like, because I'm not really big on Eggman. I don't know what the fuck he got. I know Met is, I'm assuming Metal is going to be a part of this battle, right? But who the fuck is Bowser going to utilize? His sons? Oh, no. Not up to a great start, but I'm curious. I'm mad curious. Ah, the Mushroom Kingdom. A peaceful land of kindness, adventure, love. Ah, boring. Move aside, princess. It's time this place got way more awesome. Yes, sir. Here comes King Koopa himself, better known as Bowser. Ah. The moment this orphan star child was found by Kamek, it was clear Bowser would command the disparate outcasts of the Mushroom World. Mm. The Koopa Clan. The Koopa Clan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, bro. Starting a whole clan with the letter K at this point, big 2024, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think it's it. <laughs> Golly. It must suck being a fucking turtle in the Mario universe, bro. You're getting squashed by an Italian man. It's old beast. Oh, beast. What the fuck? All right, he's 34, 10 foot. Bowser Jr., Kamek, or Comic, Koopalings, and he has a dead brother? The fuck? Got any trauma? <laughs> Hobbies, dancing, golf, go-karts, and tennis. Favorite food, cake, durum sticks, steak. Los Prince of Peace's family. Haste of Mario Bros. Yoshi's. I ain't gonna lie, he's chilling for real. Like, this man Bowser really don't be doing nothing. He's for real, he for real just chilling, yeah? Different world. But Princess Peach Toadstool would never allow the evil king's day in the sun. Her Damn. light was so bright, Bowser became infatuated with her. Of course. The government destroying minorities. <laughs> oh, he turned all the toads into bricks and kidnapped her, putting their princess in another castle. And another and another, like 40 years of castles. Do you think she has like Stockholm Syndrome at this point? I always wondered, isn't there like a whole game theory of like Princess Peach having like Stockholm Syndrome and letting herself be captured by Bowser? Hoody dude, are you victim blaming? Yes. <laughs> you're a princess and you're telling me you can't hire better fucking uh, security guards, bruh? You couldn't hire fucking Maxwell the Cat or something? You couldn't, you couldn't hire like Z Broly? Like who the fuck, bruh? Where, where are all these fucking taxes going to, Princess Peach? The fuck? Could she spending all that money on, on some whack ass dresses? And is she playing dress to impress with our fucking tax dollars? What the fuck? It's a lot of punishment. Not even the weight of a castle can scratch it. Especially when he rolls up like a prehistoric Beyblade. And the Koopa King doesn't just breathe fire and control lava. He commands nature itself. He Spe dies? Spitting meteors from outer space. Beckoning the earth with a snap. Inhaling torrents of wind. Straight up calling down lightning. What else has he got? How the fuck? Reality warping? How the fuck does he lose? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. 
I didn't know he all these, had all these powers, bro. I'm not I'm not really big on all like every single Mario game. I'm not. I only know like the basic Mario shit on the Wii and like Smash Bros. But like, bro, what the fuck? Reality warping? When the fuck? What game was this? You just fucking <laughs> wait. How the fuck do you lose? How do you not pull like reality warping powers? Like, fuck the fucking problematic issues that stem from that shit. But how are you actively not pulling like any girls or any women with reality warping, Cuddy? How? What is he like? Is he a fucking like? I don't know. Is he like Batman where he has a secret part of his brain that limits his true potential or some shit? Oh, just a little dabbling in dark magic. The fuck? Hell yeah. Wizard Turtle. The original NES manual even describes him as a sorcerer king. Magic really? is how he turned the toads into bricks. Is he like Dr. Doom? <laughs> He's Dr. Doom. Bowser spent decades hoarding treasures, coins, magic star rods, warships, clown cars, you name it. This is the same guy that created multiple flying castles fashioned after his own face. Hmm. Hey, man. He low-key is Dr. Doom, bro. <laughs> the sorcery, the ego with the fucking, like, face, the bread. He's a king. I ain't gonna lie. Bowser is Dr. Doom. Game map pack. Come out of retirement. Bro. I have a theory. <laughs> Brana plants, bloopers, and Lakitus use oh, their yeah. surroundings to get the jump on unsuspecting prey. Bro, this is about to be like D-Day. Look at all these troops. Bro, POV, me on Clash of Clans being raided by a motherfucker with Japanese letters. I'm cooked. <laughs> Your clan was raided by fucking, I don't know, Ichigo Kurosaki and like Japanese letters, bro. Yeah, that shit's gone. Let me just uninstall real quick. I know my fucking town. My town hall is in shambles, bro. My land, sea, or sky. We'd be here forever. Oh my god, that's very young. Look at his fucking legs. I don't know why, but this, this makes me uncomfortable. Oh my god. <laughs> this makes me very uncomfortable. Why do these look like fucking tips? The small fries. What the fuck? This man, Bowser, a gooner, bro. <laughs> Booze, shy guys, sentient bombs with feet, and more. It was imperative for Bowser to nurture a unit that covers their own vulnerabilities. For All example, right. Kamek and King Boo both have magic, but Blue has battlefield control with illusions and destabilizing dimensions. Okay, domain expansion? Also, what the fuck is Kamek? Is he a fucking turtle? I, I know he's- he, okay. Kamek can transform troops into copies of Bowser. King Boo can grant intangibility to others and disable an opponent. Oh, shit. Okay, but what constitutes his powers, though? Because- Eggman's intelligence isn't really a power. He's just a brilliant fucking scientist, right? If well, like, would Kamek like make him dumb or some shit? <laughs> will he just we just turn his IQ into the negatives? Also, if he can make shit intangible, like intangibility with a reality warping, how the fuck does Bowser lose? Like, dude, realistically, just be intangible and use your reality warping powers to win. And GGs. While Kamek focuses on buffing allies, canceling Got enemy you, powers. Okay. So speaking of items, most of the minions can use pretty much any power-up Mario can. Really? Goombas make frequent use of Tanuki Tails. Oh my god, they're fairies. And Bowser can- Where does I even plug- Let me show. Really get into the cat role play. Ha ha ha! What a goat. But as the Koopa Troop grew and grew, it started to feel less like an army and more like a family unit. Ah! Oh, you mean like his kids, the Koopalings. Eh, they're adopted. What's the... <laughs> okay. <laughs> they're just hearing this shit for the first time, huh? Difference. Good point. Bowser took them in and even trained them in dark magic. So no okay. one's as spoiled as his natural Nepo baby, Bowser Jr., captain of the Koopa Troop. Spoiled is an understatement. Remember his escapades at Shadow Mark? He terrorized Delfino Plaza with literal evil paint. Dude, I remember this game. Oh my god, the nostalgia. Super Mario Sunshine. I should just brought back memories, bruh. Never finished this game, though. Fuck this game. Really? The king is very protective of his kids. Oh, this is an order, but also I'm asking you as a concern. Bro, this is why Bowser is such a goat, bruh. He's literally a gooner, rich, a king, and he's a great father. Right? And he adopts orphans, bro. This man, Bowser, is not a villain, bro. He's just misunderstood. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. D uh, D1 misunderstood father. It's That's my goat. The He's better than y'all's fathers. Maybe a little overkill. Just one punch from giant Bowser launched a castle out of orbit. How does he fucking lose? Oh, okay. No, oh, don't bully his kid. Ah. Especially if he falls into some of Bowser Jr.'s set of black paint. That stuff's scary. Enough. Bowser just runs into prime rice gum, just bullying his child. Just 
Enough to unleash Bowser's Dark Fury, a form whose very steps cause widespread natural disasters. What okay, the seriously, fuck? what is How this? Has Mario ever oh, beat this guy? That's what I'm saying. Like Godzilla, Doctor Strange, and John Cena all in one big turtle. Oh, uh, we're not even to the best part. What? Let me show you how to block this ad. Fuck off! Bowser's dark magic became so potent he eventually learned how to warp the very fabric of reality. Did that motherfucker hit him with a Gallic gun or was that a spirit bomb? Any I didn't know Bowser was like what the fuck? <laughs> Freaky ass bitch, he is 69 god. Look at his fucking nose. Cause that's a chub. Oh my lord, bro. This man Bowser a freak. Thing the king imagines he makes happen. He turned all of Yoshi's Island into a storybook. And remember those but he laced them. powerful items like the Wonder Flower, which can mold reality like Play-Doh, and the Dream Stone, which can be used to wish someone out of existence. But his most the iconic thefts are those big shiny power stars. Don't judge a book by its cover. Infant power stars, aka Lumas, can become whole galaxies. They also ferried Mario across the universe in three seconds. That's 489 quadrillion times light speed. This motherfucker actively bullies Goku and Vegeta. Obviously, the Big Daddy Grand Stars are even crazier. Bowser used one to power his space kingdom, but then guess who showed up to ruin everything? It's a him! And when the Grand Star was freed, it caused a chain reaction that destroyed the entire universe via a massive black hole. Bro, POV fucking Richard gets a job in the Amazing World of Gumball. <laughs> Thanks, Space God, that Rosalina showed up to save the day. Not that Bowser needed saving. He's what been the fuck? Imagine if this crazy OP fire turtle had to fight himself. Oh, wait, he did, and he beat the hell out of him. What? I did not know any of this, bro. What the fuck? Lifted a 61,000 ton castle. Uh, what the fuck? What is this fucking LeBron James ass resume? Conquered most of the universe twice. Harnessed the power of grand stars. Flew to the sun and other galaxies. All right. Lifted a 61 ton castle. Battled the extra dimensional Culex. Survived being thrown across the planet. Helped Mario save the Mushroom Kingdom and defeated Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, Dementio, and Fawful. Bro, what the fuck? This man Bowser is like the anti-spiral if the anti-spiral fuck the anti-spiral. Whatever really what he saw. Surrounding him is a crew of outcasts and miscreants like him. Rioter dies that can't be swayed against him. Oh. Oh, are you saying he's secretly happy? Cause That's my goat, bro. He's got a big monster family now. That's my goat. Oh, yes, but... What the fuck? Never, hold on. Never mind, never mind. I did not co-sign this. Also, when they actually worked together, they legitimately conquered most of the known universe. So... He's a baddie through and through who will teleport through space and time to show you what's what. Because he's no ordinary Hey, Cuba. this shit is Make hard! Way for the king! Hey! Okay, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. Okay, Bowser, okay, I ain't gonna lie. Bowser might be one of my favorite characters in fiction. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like, what the fuck? I did not know he could do all this shit. Oh my. I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited. This is about to be fun. This is about to be far. Watch, watch like Bowser versus Eggman be like fucking D Day. It's like it's like Hank Shaw Ridge, <laughs> the most brutal death battle. I hope I hope it's like that. Like I want to see Koopas fucking crying and shit, yo. Like I want this to be brutal, a brutal war. This battle is sponsored by Prize Picks. Fuck Prize Picks. Citizens of Earth. Oh my God, are you sure? <laughs> Citizens of Earth. This does not look like Earth. This has got to be Mars. Look at this fucking ugly child. Oh my fucking God, look at this ugly man. <laughs> Dude, this is not Earth, bro. Cuddy, you cannot fool me, Cuddy. I know your game. This is Mars. Isn't it disgusting? Oh. Now, imagine a better world. One with proper guidance and the technology to bring about global... Cuddy, the Industrial Revolution personified. <laughs> Cuddy, he's fat Bezos. He's a genius at heart who knows the dangers within. Ah! He's Ivo Robotnik. God, this build is fucking crazy. He is thick as fuck, though. POV, the average torta. <laughs> How, how does one obtain this build, bro? Was God just like crafting Eggman's physique and just laughing his ass off? He probably is crying, dude. <laughs> Duck. It's like Ark. <laughs> it's his grandfather, Gerald Robotnik, who sought to create world peace through technology. But okay. then his beloved <laughs> fucking Maria got fucking quick scoped. <laughs> Should he run into phase Jeff? Beloved granddaughter Maria was killed by the Guardian. <laughs> dude, I like how he's looking. It just kept shooting, dude. They even stopped. of nations. They turned into Swiss cheese. They turned it into a fucking Connect Four board. Eggman Land. He's 50, 6'1, 
Okay, okay, okay. Occupation, CEO of Eggman Industries, Meteor Tech, Hobbies, Archaeology, History, Woodworking. Okay, favorite foods, egg dogs. What the egg dogs? Egg candy? Oh, shit. I don't know. His fucking kidneys are crying, bro. His liver probably looks like the Sahara Desert, bro. That shit is cooked. Popping egg corn. Ew. Okay. Ew. Big ones. He invented a spatial displacement trap, which... Oh. While online, scatters the target's atoms across space. Oh, okay, okay, this is about to be fire. Oh, and then there's the metal virus. Which... What? This is how AI... Fuck off! It optimizes my schedule. Cuddy, optimize the job, you fucking bum. This meeting got canceled. Hooray! That's it? You? Why do you need AI for that, you fucking narc? You fucking loser? The fuck? Oh, so I know your schedule does not look like this, buddy. I, I know it does not. You know what this looks like? Cry, 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 cry. You fucking bum. We didn't really want to go anyways. Shut up, nerd. Mobile. It's lightweight for maneuverability, but tough enough to withstand moon-sized explosions in even the center of a black hole. What the fuck? I mean, it's kind of lame looking, but he can plug it into big bad mechs like the Egg Walker or the Death Egg Robot. Who did Titanfall? Giant laser once obliterated 77,000 cubic meters of rock in an instant. I'm... Imagine like just being a child, right? And you're just playing in the street and you get fucking lasered to death by Eggman testing out a new toy. That's always been funny as shit to me. Like, imagine a kid that has ambitions of being like the president or some shit. I don't fucking know. Right? And he's just playing like basketball, you know, working on his handle in the middle of the street. And like, out of the corner of his eye is a twinkle of red, right? And he gets final flashed into oblivion. That's honestly fucking hilarious to me. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Pretty cool. Eggman built machines for a long list of combat situations. So, what's his infatuation with like eggs and shit? I never got that. I know there's like a whole premise to it, right? Well, like, what? Is, did he like. Is, does he really just love eggs? Or was he bullied as a kid and like just said, fuck it. You know what? If you don't call me eggs, I'm gonna make everything egg themed. Like, he's like Batman. Is he like egg phobic? So <laughs> he's just scared of bald people. He sees fucking, I don't know, he sees a random bald person, goes into like a fucking shock. He goes into cardiac arrest. To say Eggman doesn't enjoy scrapping with blue hedgehogs himself. Where does he get the funding for this? Because I know he has a corporation, but people recognize he's a bad guy, right? So again, why are they still like... Huh. Is it really that easy to manipulate people? <laughs> I'm gonna be your god. Give me all your money. <laughs> And don't forget, Eggman built all of these things himself. Maybe world domination is in his grasp yet. One How the fuck does he have the time to make all these things? Could he get a job? <laughs> get a girlfriend, bruh. Problem. Eggman's a turbo loner. No hobbies, no friends, no wife, no nothing. <laughs> Who's really winning, bitch? As he just obliterates my city block. Come on, he has friends. I mean, he's a feminist. Really? Maybe not, but what about Infinite? Sure, they might have joined forces over a mutually sought revenge. Is he wearing fucking Jordans? Hold what on. about Infinite? Sure, they might have joined. Are these raps? Cutty Rock and Osiris is <laughs> big 2024. I love it. But that's why he's made top notch bots modeled after the Sonic cast, like everyone's favorite robo Metal. figure, ah! Metal Sonic. Metal that's the goat. Metal Sonic has the most horsepower in the Eggman Empire. He has the moves and speed of Sonic and then some. Mm. And Sonic CD, Sonic Dodge and Light Beams from Hotaris and. Uh, Cool. Okay. I never understood this like trope where like, oh my god, they fucked up your haircut. They were so close to cutting you. Like it happens everywhere, right? Where's the fucked up haircut? Cause I wanna see I wanna see a fucked up hair. I wanna see that trope done correctly. I wanna see that motherfucker have a fucked up hairline for two months, bro. A fucked up haircut for two months. I want that shit. He's commit to it. Had his rebellious phases, but Eggman's reprogrammed Metal to better follow his commands. Additionally, when upgraded to his Neo form, Metal Sonic could copy biological data, including unique powers like Shadow's time stop technique, chaos control. He could even. How the fuck do you copy a time stop technique? The fuck? Go up, King! And when used on the planet's consciousness, which is a thing, the Ruby okay. granted Eggman the Lightman form. So he can go super... Okay, this is a lot to unpack here, right? Why the fuck does a planet have a consciousness? And two, what is Earth's consciousness? It's like... It's like... Is it, does Earth, like, listen to Glow Riddler or some shit? That'd be my head can I go lie. That'd be fire. <laughs> and two, or three... Why the fuck can he go Super Saiyan? Super Saiyan Hedgehog! Eggman built and built huh. and built, and eventually, he built something that started to build on him. 
What? Sage was originally designed as a mere assistant, but through an alien encounter, she was granted actual sentience. Oh no, what the fuck? I could have created Siri. Sage is already super powerful, but- It's chat GBT. Now she's also super smart. She thought up millions of battle plans all at once to defeat the massive titans. And you can barely remember where you put your dune buggy. I know exactly where it is. It's at the police impound. Thank you very much. Sage was Eggman's saving grace. He had previously found machines with personality lacking, but Sage's great adequacy in serving her function provided Eggman with something that, for the first time, He'd hate to lose. They fuck. In essence, a, a sort of daughter. Oh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so fucking sorry. Uh, I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> One emerald can shift continents. All seven together can shift the universe. And oh. kill some pretty terrifying bosses, like Eggman's Time Eater. I ain't gonna lie, the, the boss designs in all the Sonic games are by far one of the coolest ever. I'm not gonna hold you. Like, can we talk about it? Like, the music for Sonic is fire. The boss designs are fire. But the gameplay itself is fucking ass. Like, that's what sucks about it. Because the Sonic world, in my opinion, like the designs of the actual villains, again, like I said, like I said multiple times, they're a peak. It's peak fiction. Right? The music OST, peak fiction. But the actual gameplay, Cuddy, it makes me want to off myself. I ain't gonna lie. First battled Solaris, who tried to destroy time itself. Solaris extended its chaos across multiple timelines in about 20 seconds. What the fuck? Or 73 quadrillion times light speed. It's funny though. While Eggman's smarts have sort of defeated Sonic here and there, he's pretty effective when he teams up with the Blue Blur to save the world. Well, recall how Professor Gerald was a good person before losing the granddaughter he loved. Oh, so now he got a daughter he's now fucking Gerald or some shit it's, it's it's coming back to him in Eggman's case now that he has Sage perhaps a similar story is playing out in reverse <laughs> let's pray she, let's pray this one doesn't get into a Call of Duty lobby nah <laughs> he will always have a harebrained scheme behind his cufflinks so watch out critters and plebeians of the world he is the Eggman and he's got the master plan Okay, okay, this is, I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, bro, if Bowser loses, all I'm asking is for you to murder Sage, because that would be fucking hilarious. <laughs> like, if Bowser loses, that would, I would suck, I would, I would be sad, but if Sage at least gets taken out during, like, the fuck, is one of the casualties, bro, that'd be the funniest shit. Through all possibilities. Okay. It's time for a death battle! Alright, 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 alright. I'm, okay, before it starts, I'm rooting for Bowser. Easy, all right? Bowser, the fucking father, the fucking eldritch horror, right? A fucking god. Cool as shit. And his, and his like, whole army is based off being a family, right? Being a group of outcasts. Cuddy, he's basically fucking odd future, right? So, Eggman, fat, bald. He has a daughter, but it'd be funny if his daughter died because, you know, Maria died. <laughs> Please, Bowser, just take out Sage. That's all I'm asking for. I think Bowser could win this shit, though. Right? Bowser has, like, more forms. And plus, he can make him intangible, so you can't really kill him. Or the fucking, like, wizard fuck. Huh. You know what? I'm, I'm, I'm rooting for Bowser. Fuck it. Oh! Plus, he has a butt chin, and plus Jack Black. Oh. Yes, sir. <laughs> Did he POV that one fucking, uh... Rap video, I forgot what it was, AMG? Real Hustlers Anthem or some shit? Oh, this mother- Bro, he- this man got catfished. <laughs> POV, that one homie beating his Valorant girlfriend IRL, cutty. Y'all, this is what y'all Discord mods be doing. I've come to make an announcement. This territory is now the base for my upcoming Eggman land too. Cutty, fuck you. What a joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh You're yeah. Genius overlord. Oh yes, sir. Okay, guys, I ain't gonna like it. This better be a fucking bloody war. I want this shit in history books in the Mario universe as like the equivalent of how we like talk about D Day or some shit, yeah. <laughs> What he said? <laughs> Shut up, nurse! 
Shut up, nerd. He just let me through, bitch! Hey! Oh, fuck your fucking thing, bro. POV Gojo. Oh, let me sit up. Let me sit behind. Let me sit behind. Oh, I thought he died already. I'm about to say, bro. Cuddy, this man really stole Dr. Doom's whole flow. We're not going to talk about it, Cuddy. You're not Doom. You call these toys an invasion force? But see, toads do better. I'm decoying the idiot. This power is without peer. It is the ultimate strength. Oh, what a bitch. This man built a robot that can go a fight for real, bruh. He calling in his little fucking butt buddies. Oh, you're a bitch. Oh, this motherfucker's a bitch. And he killing the homies. He killed Ugg. Oh, nah, bros. You... I'm ready for Bowser, bro. This man, Eggman, is a D1 bitch. He's not even boxing for real. He's fucking, he's a little bitch-ass nerd, little fucking loner, fucking little jerking off in his goon cave, making all these fucking machines. Cuddy, what a bitch. Nah, fuck Eggman, bro. I'm ready for Bowser. Oh, yeah, good, there we go. Good shit. Dumbass. Look at his dumbass. Come on, fuck. Good fucking shit. Cuddy, replay that shit. That's bro. My brother just another like bro. No, that's that's my brother. Fuck out of here. Go fucking move. Go move. Come on, Gary, Henry. Motherfucker, can you pick this pocket, bitch? Go move. Oh my God, it's the goat. Oh good shit. This shit is live, bro. This shit is so cool. Give me that shit, bring that at bro. This is so cool. That's my go. He's fun, he's fun. Ain't that shit. No, sir! You've lost the battle before it has begun. Oh, well, shut the fuck up, you fucking bitch. Excellent work is always better. Ready to wrap this up, Sage? As you command. You know what they say. The more oh, yes, sir. Oh, good shit. Good shit, son. Showtime. Hey! Oh, my God, it's me. Bitch! Now turn, hey, turn Sage into a fucking, I don't know. It's like a fu y'all know how fucking, how like wine is made? Use her as fucking grapes, Scotty. Just smush that bitch together. Fuck this, oh, she's talking shit. Fuck Eggman, fuck his whole fucking clan, bro. What? Don't do it. You can still earn income. On nah, Cuddy, do that shit. Fuck you. You interrupted my death battle. Learning on a real note, don't do it, Cuddy. There's always something better, right? Because I'm uploading tomorrow as well. <laughs> Let me chill. Oh my god. Bitch! Oh my fucking god. He's chilling. Oh, good shit. Good fucking shit, bro. Bro, that's that's bro. This is getting me hype, bro. No. But okay, Bowser really have nobody on par like Metal Sonic and shit. I lied. Damn. I did not lie. No! Dare you keep your hands off my hey! No, this is something. That is oh no, I'm gonna speed. I'm gonna speed. No, this is the best one. I'm gonna but this is the best level. This is the best level. This is the best one. This is the best one. This is the best one. No. no, shut the fuck up. What he said? Hey! I'm conflicted though, cause I love Metal Sonic, but fuck. The death egg. Max power. No, my God, save, save me! Get the fuck out of here, Betty! Pick up yourself from your bootstraps, bitch! Oh, fuck the fucking like Death Star ripoff! Even eat that shit to watch. That's my.
my goat, bro. This man knows to run and hide like Eggman like a bitch, Cuddy. He's for real stand ten toes right in front of everybody. That's my goat. Nah, I fought with Bowser. Bowser's my fucking guy. 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 Oh, no, okay, wait, no, the skeleton, no, he can revive himself with the skeleton, right? He can revive himself with the skeleton. He's fine, he's chilling, he's chilling. I know the game, Cuddy, I, re I read this shit. I, re I really do this shit, Cuddy, I'm, I'm a I really do this shit. He's chilling, he's chilling. Reanimate stuff. Revive yourself. Yes, sir! Good shit. Oh, don't let me press. Let me pray this shit. That's that's hard. This is hard as fuck. Now, this is the hardest fucking. This is thumbnail. This is thumbnail. Cut it, yo. This is fucking hard. This is hard as shit. Now, this is hard. This is hard. This is hard. Cut it, this is hard. If my son ain't like this, cutie, I don't want it. If my son or daughter's not like this, cutie, I don't fucking want her. Good fucking shit. Hey, GG's bitch. GG's bitch. Sage. Fire is dead. Oh, fuck your fuck, Sage. Yeah, turn that shit into a lucky block, bitch. Alan Becker over there crying and shit. I know he about to make some peak right now. Cuddy, turn that motherfucker into a lucky block. Cuddy, all that fucking hard on reaches. What does it amount to? Nothing, bitch. Nah, fuck this motherfucker up. Now you crying. Now you crying talking about some weight. Oh, no, he about to go super. He about to go super whatever the fuck. Another fucking ripoff. Yo, go fucking move. Go fucking move, nephew. So long, doctor. <laughs> Black Flash? Cuddy, did this man just hit him with a black flash? So long, doctor. He fucking did! Ooh. That's my goat. Is that please let that be game? That's game. This is the best that battle. I don't go for this is the best that battle. This is the best that battle. This is the best one. This is the best one. This motherfucker Eggman really stepped on his fucking city. This man Bowser was for a chilling, right? He was he thought he was he thought he met a baddie, right? But you know what he did after he realized he got catfish? He didn't cry. He didn't do nothing. He picked himself up and started boxing, bruh. And this man Eggman was for a running away like a little bitch, cutty. With a fucking with his little trash ass fucking Corolla trying to drive off. <laughs> Somebody help me. Cutty, fuck you and your whole family, bruh. Good shit, bro. Good shit. That was peak. I ain't gonna lie. This might have been one of the best ones. This, 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 this is probably one of the best ones I've watched. These are one of the best ones I've watched. This is one of the best ones. I ain't gonna lie. This is phenomenal, bro. Shout out Boomstick and Jizz once again, yeah. <laughs> this was awesome. That was cool as fuck, bro. That's what... Bowser might be one of my favorite characters of fiction. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> like, unironically, at this point. That shit is... <laughs> he might be one of my best... He, he might be, bro. He probably is. He probably is. He probably is. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna wrap up today's video. But if you liked the video, like the video. If you didn't like the video, I, I, I'm sorry. Not really. I, I don't give a, I don't give a fuck, bro. bro. <laughs> hey, this was awesome, bro. If you want me to add anything, anything more specific, let me know in the comments below. But that's gonna wrap up today's video, brody. Peace.